Yo, what's good, bro? Yeah, we're gonna be uh, replacing a burner assembly in this video, but uh, I'm not gonna really talk about the video today. I'm gonna hit you with a joke, man, while we watch. Uh, it's a little bit of a long-winded joke, but I think it's pretty funny. I think it's worth sharing. So, anyway, uh, hope you enjoy, man. So, stories about a dude who loves driving trains. Okay, he loves trains. It's his passion. It was his passion as a kid with the little toy tr trains and stuff. Uh, and now he's doing it for a living. And he loves to go fast, man. He loves to pedal to the metal and charge. But uh, because of that, he is reckless and he doesn't really abide by the laws and standards of the train industry. So one day he is being very reckless and he's charging and he ends up killing a person. He gets into a crash, he kills someone. He gets arrested and he's tried and he's found guilty and he's sentenced to the death penalty by electrocution. And so uh, the next morning, I guess, because I guess whenever he's tried, uh, that morning he gets a meal and the meal of his choice is one banana. So he eats the banana and after he eats, he gets put into the chair. They strap him down, they fire it off and everything's fine. Like he survives, nothing's wrong with him. Now, the culture in the day of age in which this guy lived, uh, there was a law that if you survive the death penalty, it was considered uh, an act of God, of, of God intervening and preserving this person. And so they would get released. And so this guy gets released and he finds his way back into the train industry. He's driving a train again. And he ends up getting reckless. He ends up getting into another crash. He kills two people this time. Goes through the whole process again. He's arrested. He goes to court. He's tried. The morning of, he asks for his last meal. He asks for two bananas, right? He eats his two bananas and he gets strapped into the chair. They fire it off. He's normal, he's fine. Let him go again. Happens again three times, bro. The third time, he ends up getting into a crash. He kills three people, okay? Asks for the morning of, he gets tried again, the whole process, the morning of, he asks for three bananas. And the executioner is like, nah, we're not giving you any bananas, dude. You're not even getting a meal. You're going empty stomach. Strap him in the chair, fire it off. And still, he's normal. Nothing's wrong. Executioner's tripping. He's like, how are you still alive? How are you not dying? You didn't even have a banana. And uh, the guy responds back, well, the bananas had nothing to do with me. I'm just a bad conductor. Yeah, man. 